Hello everyone! Let's talk about boobs, baby! Let's talk about boobs and me! There's no way this video is getting monetized. <laughs> um, we're talking boobs today, people. Wow, do I ever get comments about my boobs. Whenever I do any kind of a try-on video, haul video, what have you, I get the comments! Cassie, you should really buy a better bra. Cassie, your boobs are sagging. Cassie, your boobs though. I mean, just, I know a lot of people mean well, uh, but let me just say, I struggle as I feel like most people with breasts do in that we want to be comfortable, but we also want to look good. Now, these two things have a very hard time going together because usually comfort does not come with societal standards of what good-looking boobs look like. You know, the media and everything has us thinking that everyone should have perky boobs, no sag, nipples to the high heavens, and that's just not the case. It's the reason why I wore my Trailer Trash Tammy boob t-shirt today, just because I thought it was very fitting, but also because I have been on a semi-long journey of, you know, learning to love my body as is and what I was given to work with. My boobs, I don't care what kind of a bra you put them in, they're never gonna be perky and high because they are big and just the way that my anatomy turned out, they start quite low on my chest. I have a very flat kind of a chest here and then they just kind of broke out of that. You know, it's not the typical like perfect blue, it's just burnt. And for the longest time I hated that. I really hated that those were the cards or the boobs that I was dealt in life. Well, I have tried to love myself, love my boobs, and a lot of that came by just wearing very comfortable bras that I had gotten from True & Co that I still wear to this day. They're very comfy. I love them. However, A, many of you want to see me try actual bras, and B, I have some clothing that that I feel like would benefit from more of a bra bra rather than a True & Co type of, it's not a sports bra, but it's more in that vein. So I figured let's kill two birds with one stone here. Let's try out a company and some bras that I see advertised all the time, mainly on Instagram. It is third love here. This is not sponsored. I just wanted to order bras from them because they look very comfortable. I love that they have many many different kinds of bras you take your whole fit quiz where you see what kind of bras that they carry that are gonna fit your breast shape the best what size you are what size you think you are how does your band fit how do your straps fit do your cups gape do your boobs spilleth over how old is your current bra all that kind of stuff and they give you a wide selection of breast shapes to pick from you know they know that not every Everyone has that Hollywood perfect boob shape. So they let you pick which picture your boobs look like and as I said all the rest of that information and then from there they give you certain styles that they make that they think will fit your breasts the best. So uh, these are pricey. These are expensive bras. They are almost $70 a piece. They are $68. You do get a bit of a discount when you bundle them. You know if you order more than one you'll get a discount off. The more you buy the more you save type of a thing. So I got three of them. Let us see how they are. Now I agree with what they say in here. It says the best bra is one you never think about. Agreed, because that means it's comfy if you're not even thinking about it. Now let's see. I mean this all came very nicely packaged. And also they've got a good return policy in that you can actually wear these and try these, but if you don't like them you can send them back. Sorry, crinkle crackle paper. It's been so long since I've held an actual bra in my hands, but you know, we're gonna try them out. So I ordered all of mine in a 40C. I hope that'll be my size. That's what I typically wear. And they said, based on what I told them, that I am wearing the correct size. So first up, we have got the 24-7 classic t-shirt bra. Let me show you everything they say. I do believe this is their most loved bra. It's got eight different color choices you can pick from. I do love that as well. That 
that they've got a bunch of different like nude colors for people of many different skin colors. They also have a couple of different models that you can see it on, you know, if you want to see it on a smaller chest size or a bigger chest size. And yes, they say that this is the bra that apparently started it all for them. This has signature memory foam cups, which I assumed it was going to be pretty thick, but this is really, really thin. But it's going to form to whatever your unique shape is and create a smooth silhouette. It's got soft supportive straps and includes sizes A through I as well as their signature half cup sizes. Yeah, just lots of things that say that this is going to be smoothing and comfortable. Mainly all of those things are going to come from the pleated strap design, memory foam cups, and smoothing microfiber. So I just got this in the, what did they call this? Hope. Next up, one that looks very similar. This is the 24-7 Perfect Coverage Bra. This is $68, but it's got wonderful reviews. Comes in seven different colors. I myself got the Twilight shade, which I think is gorgeous. So they just say that this is like the t-shirt bra, but this one is slightly fuller coverage, which I usually tend to like. It kind of makes it so you can't spill it over, but it's got the same thin memory foam design that's going to be soft and supportive at the same time. It's gonna form to you and be nice and smoothing. It's never gonna dig in. Wraps are never gonna slip available in sizes D through H and 32 through 48 band sizes. And then, you know, just talks about all the details of the bra. This also, along with the memory foam cups and smoothing back, has softly padded straps, apparently. These don't feel padded, but hey, you know, that that's what they say, so okay. And now, last but not least, actually wasn't expecting this with this bra, but we've got the 24-7 Classic Uplift Plunge Bra. This one is going to be if you're going to want a little bit of a cleavage, but still want some pretty good coverage. I didn't realize that the mesh detail covered the whole cup. I thought it was just kind of a detail up top here, but this one does have removable padded cups on the side, and it comes in six different colors. I just got classic black. And they just say that this is going to emphasize your natural cleavage. It's an elevated take on the traditional push-up bra. This is going to eliminate cup gaping and includes removable inserts for an extra push-up when you want it, as I said. It's got the flattering v-neckline finished with a smooth, a smooth scratch-free band. That is very difficult to say. <laughs> it's available in double A through I, including their half cup sizes, as well as bands 30 through 48. Got all these details and the things that I I basically already mentioned. I am excited to try these on. It's gonna feel very weird putting on a bra like this. <laughs> it's been a long time, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it together. It will be an experience. You know, I'm gonna hope, hope, hope that I might get this video monetized. We'll see. Uh, so I'm not gonna show you the bras like as a bra, but uh, you'll see it underneath this white t-shirt, you know? I think it'll be able to show it off. Vision, hey, so here I am with my True & Co bra on. So there you go. I mean, as I said, not a lot of lift, but my boobs can't be lifted too high. I mean, my chest ends here, boob starts here. You can only really push that up so much. Yeah, I just like that it, for the most part, you know, it smooths the back. I don't have to worry about any more extra rolls than I already have on my own. And it's just, it's comfortable. However, all right, I think I might need to exchange these for a 42 band size. This feels quite tight. So it's, it's hard for me to know. Some brands I feel like I do a 42, some brands I do a 40, but I actually really like the way that this fits my boobs. I mean, it like just hugs them perfectly. They feel very supported. Like there's really no jiggling going on there. Probably see this is really cutting into my back quite a bit. I wish the band was a little bit thicker, but aside from that, I mean, I think looks and feels very comfy. I mean, am I really gonna get demonetized for this? Probably. Can you see it just hugs my boobs right, right where they're at? Here we have the perfect coverage bra. This one doesn't fit me quite as well. I feel like, I mean, I, like many women, have different sized breasts. It's not a, a huge amount, but this boob is a bit smaller than this boob, and there's just the slightest bit of gaping in this cup because of that. It also feels a bit tight, maybe not as tight as the last one with the band. This feels much more like my old bras that I used to have. 
it's very comfortable like it really it really is and this one seems to give me a bit more lift than that last one maybe so this one I don't know if maybe I would need to go up my band size and up the cup size or maybe see if they have half cups in this one a bit all right and here we have definitely my least favorite one this plunge bra it does not fit me well there is large gaping and absolutely no cleavage <laughs> at least not for me i do i think this one has the widest band which i really like better but as i said can you see can you see the little bit of a lot of bit of gaping there. So, this one's a bummer for me, for sure. This one I would just return, not even exchange it. All right, so there we go. I just went ahead and checked on their returns. Since they say it's supposed to be nice and easy, and then I saw that there's no return label included. So what you do is you go online, you put in your email, and then they will send you an email to start your return. It was really easy. I show that purchase that you made, and then you click on each bra and say if you want to return or exchange it and why, and bada bing, bada boom, that's it. You have to download a shipping label, print that out yourself. But otherwise, I'm excited for my two two bras that I'm exchanging, both from a 40C to a 42C. But hopefully those will fit much more comfortably in terms of the band. I wish they said some of the bras you will get like a return code so that you can instantly go and just for the price of that one bra, then you can go and just pick a different bra. But I did not get that with the black bra that I tried out, which is too bad because I would have totally exchanged it and tried out a different bra of theirs but tis what it is i hope you guys enjoyed this video seeing me try on new bras let me know how you feel if there's any other bra companies you think i should try out i am very pleasantly surprised you know i do think the two bras that i'm keeping they feel very comfortable so i'm excited to have those and see how often i wear those instead of my true and co bras type of a thing you know to see if it was really worth it if i end up grabbing for them i can definitely see myself grabbing for them as i said you know if you know maybe i'm going on a date or I'm going to a family occasion where I guess I want my boobs to look more societally acceptable or just if I have a certain t-shirt or blouse that I think will look better with a more fitted uplifting bra you know I can see myself reaching for these for sure so I am happy with my experience it wasn't perfect but I do think I got some good finds here I hope it was helpful for you guys certainly let me know in the comments down below if there are any other bra companies like I said that you want me to try out and uh, also let me know if you have tried third love what was your experience like also also let me know if there are any specific third love bras that you find to be most comfortable like I said I would like to find one that creates a nice cleavage but uh, for me that certainly is not the one that I tried <laughs> anyways just let me know all the things in those comments down below you can also let me know if you enjoyed this video or found it helpful by giving it a thumbs up down below Hello. I would really appreciate it. And if you're new here, hey, hi, hello, how are you? You can go ahead and subscribe. You can tippity tap that notification bell down below. Become a member of my casserole family here on my channel. I'd love to have you here. And as always, I just hope you guys are all doing well. And until next time, just stay well until then. Bye.